So this anime did not have a trailer either, or a new trailer, and I didn't have that much time to go find one. But this anime is called The Private Tutor to the Duke's Daughter, which is coming out in 2025. That is the news that about what uh, that's the news of this anime. Private Tutor to the Duke's Daughter. Anime reveals main cast. So that's what uh, that's what they also re uh, revealed. It's the main cast. And I do have that main cast. Ahead of a planned 2025 release, the official website and accounts for the private tutor to the Duke's daughter, Anime Today revealed a teaser visual and commemorative illustration by original light novel illustrator Kura, along with the fantasy series main cast and production staff. I don't have that. I just have the main cast. I don't have um, final find out who's working on it. <laughs> um, I suggest find find the website that has that information. Uh, I don't focus on like who's working on it. Uh, whoever's working on it, and it turns out to be good, then congratulations, you made a great anime. Or told a great anime. There's the key visual right there. Of course, that's the main character, the Duke's daughter, of course. And then the rest of the other uh, supporting cast. And then there's the tutor, I would say. Right there next to the girl in red. And then there's the illustration of the illustrator. The key visual art of the illustrator, Kura. Hopefully I'm saying that right. And then here's the main cast who is going to be playing these characters. There, So there's Ellen and his voice actor. There's Tina Howard and her voice actor or voice actress. So the main, uh, if you don't um, know the story, or read it from the manga or the light novel, then this is the Duke's daughter, Tina. There's Ellie Walker and her voice actress. And then you have Lydia Leinster or Leinstar and her voice actress. After failing the final exam for his dream job at the Royal Court, wonder how tough that exam is for somebody, I guess, I would assume that this uh, Allen guy is a very powerful wizard or sorcerer or magic caster. For him to fail an exam like that, hmm, I don't know. A promising young sorcerer, Allen wants nothing more than to per to retreat to a simple life in the countryside. So, since uh, the plan was to either pass the exam and if he doesn't pass then just go back i guess he could it could be a promise made to him uh to not to him but to his one of his parents or both of his parents depending on if he has both parents that if he doesn't succeed in his dream of his of being a royal court magician then or sorcerer <laughs> royal court sorcerer then he has to come back home and um, ha they already have a job for him out there already. Fortunately for him, he can't even afford the train fare, so he can't even go back home. <laughs> he's he's that poor; they can't go back home. That's why he was hoping to get this dream job, this royal court source to be a royal court sorcerer. His only solution is to get a job, but this one lead this one uh, but his own lead is anything but modest duke howard one of the kingdom's most powerful nobles needs a private tutor for his daughter tina hmm. so you hire a person or somebody who failed the royal court exam to teach your daughter magic 
I wonder what the Duke is thinking. Tina is incapable of casting even. Okay, despite her academic brilliance, so she is very smart. I forgot to say that. So she's extremely smart, so she doesn't need like an academic tutor. That's what that means. She needs somebody to teach her the ways of magic. Tina is incapable of casting even a single spell. So she can't cast a spell. <laughs> uh, so you got an anime that is trying to find the way of magic. And this, uh, this girl, Tina, doesn't know how to cast a spell. This is more interesting. The, the more I read, the more interested I'm getting. To make matters worse, entrance exams for the prestigious Royal Academy are fast approaching. And I would assume this uh, exam that she has to take for this Royal Academy has both a written exam, which is something that she will probably pass, and a magical exam that <laughs> she has no hopes of passing. So. Like, I don't know what type of time frame, what uh, they said, <laughs> uh, they even said that what well, makes, to make some matter worse, entrance exams for the prestigious Royal Academy are fast approaching. So you might not have that long to teach her the way to cast magic. That's the issue. She can't cast a magic spell, not a single one. So he is time consumed. So he doesn't have like a year. He probably doesn't even have six months. He probably has like three months. Three months to, I would say three months. Maybe the like longer. Maybe it is six months. Maybe he has six months to teach. Uh, it would be worse if he had like a month to teach her how to cast a spell. But maybe it does take that long for her to cast, to get taught how to cast a spell. Got to be a reason why she can't cast it. Could be some type of trauma that she dealt with when she was younger. And maybe she's afraid to cast a spell, but I don't know. A magical aptitude is mandatory. So you got to learn how to cast a spell. Can Alan use his unique brand of spell casting to help Tina overcome her magical impairment? Can he? Can somebody who failed the royal court exam teach somebody to cast a spell. A mystery that not even the kingdom's finest sorcerers have been able to solve. And does her father, the Duke, even want him to? Maybe he has something else planned for her. And so, since his dream was to be a royal court sorcerer, Maybe her dream was to uh, be part or go to this uh, Royal Academy school. Who knows, right? But it's, I think it's, they're both the same. She fails at casting magic and, or spells, and he fails at passing uh, the Royal Court uh, sorcery exam or the Royal Court uh, exam, his dream job. To me, it would seem like this probably would be a better job maybe to teach young magicians or sorcerers how to cast a spell if they don't know how to cast a spell. So maybe being a tutor or a teacher than a just a royal sorcerer whenever the kingdom needs you or the king needs you to be of use of them since you might basically be wasting away. I think that's what happens with all the... I would assume that's what's happening with all these uh, royal court sorcerers is that they're just wasting away. Even though they passed the exam, there's so much of them that that the king has uh, a pick of lottery on who to use. I don't know. I'm just interested. <laughs> uh, I don't know when this is coming, gonna come out. So we have no actual release date. Usually we see January or something like that, but it's 2025, so I would assume, say, June 2025, maybe fall 2025, but the earlier the better. That's the thing. The earlier the better for this anime to come out. 